Vision works cameras. Vision works cameras. Vision works cameras. Vision works cameras. Vision works camera is far superior to the other other brands that we've used. Even in the worst condition, you can still see. Uh, the resolution is excellent. Uh, very high quality product. Cheaper uh, than most cameras that we've dealt with. We've sold a few other brands of cameras. Uh, VisionWorks by far uh, exceeds uh, expectations of any camera that we've used. VisionWorks Cameras was born out of a need that we saw in the ag industry for a high quality and affordable camera. On our own farm in Oregon, we saw the value of having cameras on our equipment. At that time, the cameras either weren't durable enough or they were far overpriced. So we made the decision to find a better solution. And that's when VisionWorks was born. It's really that simple. Both with uh, reliability and durability, VisionWorks cameras just can't be beat. The ceiling on it is far superior to the other, other brands that we've used. We don't have issues with them grazing up with fog and water. When we saw the VisionWorks design and switched to it, we've been, been very happy with it. I can't see it. So I tip the camera down and I back up and I literally hook up when I can't see, but I'm using the camera. You know, the bottom line is there's three things customers are going to care about. Resolution, durability, and of course price. Our standard cameras currently have the highest resolution in the industry. They're completely dustproof submersion tested, and put through extreme conditions to ensure durability for our customers. As far as price goes, please compare our price to the industry. We believe that you're going to see that we have an extremely affordable camera system to offer. You know, we've set this standard for quality um, with our camera system so that we could be confident when we look our customers in the eye and say, we have the best cameras in the industry. We have customer that has used them just in their shop to monitor uh, their hazelnut dryer and cleaning facility. They're really nice to stick on the augers for unloading. When I'm harvesting, I watch the harvester. Everything I do is behind me and there's simply no visibility because of the shape of the articulated cap forward design. Using our cameras will help uh, increase your safety and productivity uh, with your farming, your your RV and your construction equipment. You'll feel more confident going down the road uh, and monitoring your blind spots with our cameras. I have a camera on the back of my skid loader. It works great. I just don't have to be bending my neck and looking back. But it's working real nice. You can just look over at your camera instead of uh, having to, to turn your neck and look behind you every time. When I'm spraying, I watch my spray halo to make sure I don't have plugging. Combines, we also like to put them on the back for rear view while driving down the road. Hands down, we couldn't do it without the camera. Couldn't do it. We are using the uh, Smucker's Super Sponge on our edible beans, on our pintos and our blacks to uh, go over the top and to get rid of our uh, the Palmer Amaranth that is uh, growing quite, quite profusely in our bean fields. If, uh, if the chemical, if the gramoxone drips onto the, the edible beans, onto the, the blacks or the pinnos, it does not kill them like the Banville or the Ingenia or the Roundup does. It just burns that leaf off. Whereas if we wipe it on the whole stem of the palmer or the pigweed or the kosher or whatever else the weeds that are out there, uh, if it wipes it on the stem, it kills it. So uh, we had some pretty bad uh, escapes last year in our in our soybeans, and honestly, between our neighbors and everyone I've talked to, uh, the resistant weeds are getting to be quite a bit of an issue, but with our non-GMO beans, um, a rescue treatment of Roundup is not even, uh, well, possible, uh, because you'll kill the beans with the Roundup. 
Uh, show Dad what I was talking about. He was very leery. Uh, he remembers using the rope wick in the past. And uh, although I wasn't 100% sure at the time, uh, <laughs> I did everything to convince him that uh, it's not a rope wick, Dad. And reluctantly, he went along with me. And after using them, it's definitely not a rope wick. Um, they're far superior to the old ways where we used to go in and try to get chemicals run down a tube and into the rope and he didn't get a lot of surface area to wipe the weeds with. With the sponges it's it's a lot more surface area to wipe the weed. The concentration on the actual sponge is a lot higher. Uh, so you actually get more chemical on the weeds than we ever got with rope wick. Um, once we actually got him here and used them, um, even a doubter like my dad was very impressed. This is unbelievable. Yeah, the spine holds the material 100% better than the old rope wick. Like I said, overall, very, very pleased with the product, uh, with the experience we had with it, and especially the experience with the Smucker manufacturing.